Hello, welcome. So today I'm going to be completing a tag video. I thought oh, this is quite an impromptu one, but as I'm out in nature, just rambling, I figured I would try and complete it. So I was tagged by Jon Snow a little while ago. He did a, a tag video, random and outside the box, as is always with Jon. You can always expect something quite fun and different. And he tagged me to complete a tag, which was basically based off a conversation he'd had with Claire Smith. And they were talking about the Great Fire of London and how Samuel Pepys, I think his name is, um, who was also very famous for obviously documenting most of the Great Fire of London in 1666, famously buried his cheese in his back garden because obviously it was of value to him, along with some wines and other possessions, but the cheese was, I think it was Parmesan cheese. Um, and he buried it, obviously, for a little bit of insurance, it was value. Never reclaimed it. Um, so it could still be there in whatever garden he lived in. Um, so there's still some cheese somewhere in someone's garden in London. This tag is about what fragrances you would bury in some sort of tragic, horrible thing like a great fire. I mean, obviously, this is not to be taken seriously. If there was a great fire of London ever, I wouldn't be caring about perfume. I certainly wouldn't give them a second thought. But nonetheless, this is a fun video. And we're going to do it. So I've got five minutes to think about what fragrances and memorise the ones I've got and what ones I think I would want to bury. So here we go. I'm just going to let my clock get to... I'm just going to wait for my little clock thing to get to a full minute so I, before I start timing my five minutes. And we're going to start now. Okay, so in the Fright Fire of London, I've got to think about my fragrances and I'm going to run and have to get them, although not really. Okay, I've already wasted six seconds. <laughs> so I'm going to start with the ones I've got backups of because they're the ones I absolutely love and I cherish. So we're going to start with Blue Lazuli, which is my lovely powdery tea cardamom tobacco. Going to save that. Black, uh, black Rain, love my Black Rain. So that's my dark violet scent. It's like my signature in a way on my, on my moody days, which is most days. Um, this is a rose violet, quite heavy leather and quite a sharp opening. Absolutely love it. It's like a fizzy violet. And, oh wait, I just love that one. We've got Fawn. I love my Fawn, created by Thomas O'Brien. Um, it's just a beautiful outdoorsy herbal. Oh god, I'm already halfway in. Oh my god, this is gonna be hard. I'm not gonna explain them. Let's just get into this. Oh my god, hang on a minute. Roses Berberanza. Love my baby. This is just a really rich gourmand rose. Oh my goodness, this is actually really hard. Um what other ones do I love? I love my Iris Valve by Talia des Ors. I love Bouquet Ideal. I'd have to save that because that's gorgeous. Oud Satin Mood. I love Oud Satin Mood. I would probably chuck that in as well. Um, what's those goats making that noise for? I don't know. Um, oh my goodness, I just don't. Let me think. Oh, this is embarrassing. So I've gone completely blank on what I've even got. Oh! Fishes of a garden gnome, hello. Absolutely beautiful green tobacco scent. Um, oh, Tobacco Rose by Liz by Papillon. Also, Hera. I think all my Liz Papi all my Papillon fragrances. Dryad, Hera, Tobacco Rose. I'd definitely grab them. Um, I've just thought of my Angel EDT because <laughs> I do love that one as well. Would I save Nova? I'm, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> that probably caused the fire, didn't it? It's so toxic. Um, I've got less than a minute. I've got no Dior's in here. I don't know. If I, I don't know about my Dior's. I love them, but I don't know if they're precious. Do you know what I mean? Delina, would I save Delina? Post it, yeah, maybe. I probably would actually. I chuck Delina in there as well. She needs to be in there. Um, and Meliora from Baffin to Mali. I love that one. Um, oh my goodness. Queer Beluga from Gagan, I love that fragrance. Um, oh my goodness me. Come on, Emus, help me out. What else would I save? I've only got like 15 seconds. I can't think of anything else. I guess that's the sign of it. Uh, no. I didn't really save many at all, so that was a bit useless. Right, so I think we're pretty much up. So that was just basically a very weird little video of fragrances I would save. And I've lost all of my great ones, I'm sure, in the London fire. Because my memory 
and my panic of not thinking things is shit. So there you go. That's my tag completed. Thanks so much, John, for tagging me. Um, bit of a random one today. We get to see some nice emus and some goats here enjoying their grass. So, yeah, that's it from me. Um, tag completed. It's open. Feel free. Feel free. That's all from me. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching this weird video. And thanks, John, for tagging me in it. I finally got it completed. Over and out.